volume causes a natural pulling of tissue upwards. So I've got a great analogy which I've been excited to show you. So um, have a look at this. So here's a simple model of how you can imagine the skin, the ligaments and the fat working together in youth. So we can start by placing these little sticks which represent the ligaments. They run, as you know, from the periosteum, from the deep layer, through the deep fat, and then they reach the next layer, which is the SMAS. On top of the SMAS, you have the superficial layer, and the ligaments keep running through that, and in some cases, insert into the dermis. So that's your top layer. So you can think of the skin as having these two fat compartments. Now, in this example, you can see there's loads of movement. This, this is the skin um, in a much older person where there's very little support. If you imagine placing volume underneath there, which I'll represent with these balloons, we now have a much more stable structure. It simply just does not want to lean as much because of these fat pads supporting that. Now you can imagine what will happen with age as we decrease the volume of these fat pads. So if I just let the air out, As you can see, that deflation means that there's a natural descent because when you reinflate it, because the ligaments are so firmly attached, the natural position is to, is to pull up. They, have, they stand up straight, which means the skin is also pulled back into place. So volume and lifting are, are linked through the ligaments. So, so once you understand this connection between the volume and the way that volume causes a natural pulling of tissue upwards, because when you inflate something, the, the ligament naturally wants to stand up straight, you can explain to your patients why volume and lifting are directly connected. And you will see this if you look for it. If you do a cheek treatment and you replace volume, you will see jowls improve. You've got to look for it, but it's there. It's a lifting capability of dermal fillers. And that's how it works, through, through the ligaments.